Hi guys, this is Karen. Welcome to another video. I just got back from vacation and this is all the makeup I packed. I uh, packed mainly minis. 99% of what's here are minis. The only things that really take up space are the makeup that I well the makeup the only product is just the foundation that I don't have a mini of a foundation so I took a full size and the sponge is taking place also and so without those two it will be really really small so let's see what I packed and prepare my face for a day at home just me going out with my husband to have some us time uh, because the last uh, vacation was a family vacation that was so much fun I had a blast and I will maybe um, pop up a picture of everything that's in the bag why am I holding a pen I don't know but I'll put it here so you can see everything is here let's just get started first thing that is not in the bag are these that I forgot to bring for my vacation but I'm going to use them now because I don't want my hair all over I did pack this but in a different bag and we're going to apply SPF this is kiss my face 50 face factor mineral sunscreen uh, not my fave because first of all as you will be able to see I hope this is very 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 runny and it makes me white Tur. can you see that and I didn't take the uh, necessary amount of a teaspoon I think I took a half a teaspoon can you see that isn't that weird? Now we have to... First of all, of course you can see where you applied and where you didn't. Hence it's white. But it takes such a long time to... spread all over your face. Of course, all over my eyes. Everywhere. Just like that. It takes a while and if you're not wearing foundation I don't recommend using this mineral sunscreen because it does leave a white cast. I do look like Casper. So it is fitted for Halloween I guess. <laughs> Which is just around the corner. I hope I'll be able to upload this before Halloween but Halloween is just around the corner what are you dressing up as do let me know in the comment section down below what are you dressing up as okay this was a pre of course I did all my skincare but I forgot to put my SPF and I thought I'll show you how it looks like so everything is here in my bag well, it's very hard to open here on this desk, but I really like the fact that you can spread it on the hotel table, bed, whatever is available. I had my own makeup desk at my hotel. That was really, really nice. I had a, a mirror and a very comfortable chair and a very big uh, desk. So that was really nice. But here, I don't have that luxury because everything is just spread everywhere. Of course, I also took my small mirror. That also is taking up space. I took this mini from Benefit. This is their pore, professional pore filler, primer, of course. And just taking, not a lot, just here where I have large pores usually at my T area 
or well basically around my nose is mainly where I apply this primer it's kind of smooth everything it looks really nice and on my chin because again I have big pores here now we're heading to winter soon winter is coming are you excited do you love winter or do you love summer I love the autumn and spring basically not summer not winter autumn and spring if they could be all year long I would be happy this is my Revlon color stay in the shade 250 this is a tiny bit too dark for me because I bought it at the beginning of the summer I think or something like that so I'm not using a lot because otherwise there will be a difference between the color on my face and the color on my neck I'm just spreading it with my fa uh, fingers of course I'm going over with the sponge in a minute do you like washing your sponge in hotels with the hotel soap they have the soap bar at the hotel usually I think this is one of the best soaps to remove makeup from your makeup sponge that's what I found and it works over and over and over and over just lightly just to make everything cohesive so I will not look that white oh I forgot to charge my battery that's not good okay that's it I also uh, took, did I? No, I didn't. I took this mini from Nude Sticks. I bought a six pack or a five pack minis from Nude Stick. This is the bronzer in Bondi Bay. One thing I have to say about these minis that you have to pay attention is that they get dry. I don't know why I didn't bought them a long time ago I think less than a year and they are already starting to feel dry so keep that in mind maybe it stood for a long time in the warehouse I have no idea so I'm just painting my face like we're doing in Halloween now it looks a lot but I'm going to use my sponge now just for reference this is everything that's left I, there's nothing more so I'll probably finish it if I'll put it here on my desk and use it every day I can finish it before it will dry completely but it is drier than it was when I first bought it and I have been using it, well not consistently, but I have been using it. So I'm just tapping with my sponge. This is a sponge that I washed at the hotel. So it still has a scent of the soap in the hotel. Again, the soap in the hotel, in my opinion, are great for washing your Sponges. I also brought this Tarte Mini Concealer with just applying the tiniest amount because this is very very pigmented and this is in the shade N22N and can you see this is very light even for a concealer so I'm not applying a lot just a tiny bit I did pack only cream products so cream bronzer cream highlighters cream blushes I packed two cream blushes stick blush brushes I packed these two minis one from milk makeup one from nude sticks 
The nude sticks is the nudie matte in the shade. Naughty Spice, I guess. And this is the perk from Milk Perk, really? Well, I don't see this is way too small. I have two shades. This is the Milk one. This is the only mini that I have left for Milk. The bronzers went bad. So this is the Nude Stick. This is the Milk. They're very, very similar. Oh, let's use the Nude Sticks. Again, I'm doing the same thing, just in different place. I'm doing it here. Just like that. It was really fun to take the kids off season and for vacation. That was quiet. Not a lot of people. The hotel breakfast area was very free of people there weren't really and then I'm adding a tiny bit of the milk just because I brought them both I want to use them both they're both getting dry by the way I really hope that they will last now for highlighter I did brought two things Oh, I also bought this Tarte blush in the shade Coral. Haven't used that, but I have been using their highlighter in the shade Ember Glow. And I also brought this mini from Iconic London. These are so, so cute. Let's use the Iconic London. This one you need. This is I lost the battery when I applied this, so I wiped it off because otherwise it will get dried. So let's continue. Iconic London, just a tiny bit. And I did do that's too much every side at a time, otherwise it will dry and I won't be able to work with it. So if you have this, keep this in mind. Very similar to the Rare Beauty one. Just a different applicator. And this is a very cute mini. Oh, look here, I applied too much. Can you see that? Too much? Here I did a better job. Okay, that's intense. Okay, for the eyes, I brought with me okay let's just take out all the other things okay this is it the urban decay eyeshadow primer potion just put it on my eyelid now this is i haven't used that for a long time well not that long but a while I just want something to cover and make my eyelids uh, same shade because they're a bit red and inconsistent in their color. I did bring this cute mini from e.l.f. This is their bite size in rose water. This is gorgeous for traveling. This is so small and you have all the shades you need. The only problem was that I did not bring my brushes. So I just used the shimmer. Taking the lightest shimmer. Of course I have brushes here. Okay, what did I do to myself? I don't know. Uh, I have brushes here, but the whole point is to show you what I did on my vacation, right? So I just did that. Applied one shade every day, a different shade because there are two shimmers here in this palette. You have the lightest one at the end and this one next to the dark. So you have two mattes and two shimmers. This is very, very handy and I really like it. 
for my mascara i took this mini from clinique uh, let's just clean my finger this is a mascara that you need to work with for a long time in order to see something so i did two steps first I brushed them like this, wiggle the wand, one compared to none, and then the other eye. So wiggle, 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 and for the second step I kind of took the tip of the mascara and went for individually just like that and it gives a bit more volume I think the this side turned out better the this mascara doesn't give a curl or volume or length. It just cut, coats the lashes. Black. That's all it's doing. It doesn't give me anything else. For my lips. Now these are the cutest minis I have in my collection. I have a mini lip liner. But you can basically take any other lip liners not a, such a huge difference in my opinion but I wanted to take the mini because it's a mini from Rare Beauty and I also have a mini lipstick from Rare Beauty and a mini lipstick from Charlotte a mini lipstick from Rare Beauty in the shade Humble and I have a mini from Charlotte Tilbury in one of their pillow talk that's so small this is the Charlotte Tilbury and this is the Rare Beauty these are the shades pretty I'm going to use the Rare Beauty today but I really like also the Charlotte Tilbury did you see what just happened? I just popped it out and it went missing in action where is it it just fell off and i can't find it now this is really weird maybe it falls okay never mind we're not going to use the lip liner just the lipstick never mind that i do have to find it before I step on it. This is it. This is what I... This is the look. Oh, brows, of course. Of course, brows. Where is my brow? Here you are. No, not you. Everything fails. Okay, I'm using my Anastasia Brow Gel. It has some color to it, ash brown. And I really, really love using it. I think it's at the end of its life. But we're going to squeeze whatever we can. Because this is a perfect shade match for me. Okay, now we're done. Fix the hair. This lips look too matte. Let's apply a bit of the Charlotte Tilbury. I meant too pale. Of course it's too matte. It's a matte lipstick. I had in my purse my fat oil in supermodel not this one because it's still on my purse but i have this on my purse and occasionally i apply it on top okay this is it 
this is the final look something every day nothing too crazy just normal neutral looking face that's it do let me know what you think about the look do you have these products what minis do you have i urge you not to buy anything use what you already have at home you don't have to buy minis i got these minis as samples or in uh, advent calendars or stuff like that i don't recommend buying anything overconsumption is just horrible so don't buy anything use what you already have at home and this is advent calendar season so maybe you will get a present and you can use these minis for your next vacation okay i'm just rambling okay so that's it if you enjoyed this video don't forget to give this video a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification bell that way you will know whenever i'm uploading a new video and with that said i will catch you all in my next video bye